Hi engineering janta I am Vaibhav Shukla and today I have some very exciting opportunities for all those students who were expecting some internships in 2025 Many of you had asked me sir tell us about the internships in IITs or the research organizations as well when I put out that government internship video fine So for that I immediately decided that let's let's try and build something for that but at that point of time not much internships of iit were there so we waited for the correct time where they open up the applications and i tell you out so for this i have wonderful opportunities for you but before i dive in deep go ahead follow us on all the social media handles so that you never miss any hiring update and go ahead and comment below this video whatever you like in this video whatever you want from your side to us to make it go ahead tell us in the comment section so that we can build something on it also you can stand a chance to win prep insta prime subscription for free so let's go towards the first opportunity that iits are offering and that is summer undergraduate research exposure 2025 so for this the number of intake would be 215 interns and this fellowship would be given in iit hyderabad fine so IIT Hyderabad is organizing this summer undergraduate research exposure in this out of 250 interns 100 exclusive seats are for girls only so girls it is a great chance i always focus so much upon certifications ek acha certification agar free mein mil raha ho theek hai to kya problem hai first second there are many people even you might find such people in your colleges who are doing unpaid internships or they are giving money to preparation uh, institutes that you please give us some internships fine so here you have an internship where you can get stipend where you will be paid for doing some research work for doing some internship here you will get a certification alongside the stipend and in this the certification that you get would be super valuable that would add immense weight to your resume fine so the amount of fellowship let's first of all discuss that only 15000 per intern for 2 months now this is the lump sum amount for 2 months you will have 15000 rupees for 2 months per intern or if you are enrolling in one month program then 7500 rupees per month or rupees 10000 for one and a half months if you are an intern for one and a half months you can choose one option one month duration one and a half month duration or complete two months duration and no other amount or benefit should be applicable one or two months between may and july tentatively 15 may 2025 to 14th of uh, july 2025 basically would be the tentative timeline for this this would be one to two months of duration and minimum of one month and maximum of two months can happen fine so according to your choice you will be given that apart from this you would be given the hostel accommodation in the iit hyderabad you would be given food as well there but mess charges are to be borne by the interns themselves they have to pay for the mess charges fine now only non iit hyderabad students so every tier 2 tier 3 student this is a wonderful opportunity for you fine you can go ahead take the exposure of iit fine only non iit hyderabad students with the following criteria one should be a first year msc maths physics chemistry biology or ma first year as well or the second third year of btech or b design or the third fourth year of integrated btech mtech program these people can go there basically second third year if you are in just btech if you are in btech mtech integrated program where you also have mtech after the btech immediately in that case you can have third fourth year of your degree there you can go fine in this program you should be among the top 20% based on the cgpa percentage score in all the previous years in that discipline in the college institution and university so basically your university has to certify that you are in the top 20% of the students in that particular institution in the previous particular years fine so that has to be certified by the head of the institute or principal the applicant should be a full time regular student at the time of the application until the completion of internship you should be a regular student of the university or institute 
and you should be able to work full time minimum for one month for the internship part time or online internship is not allowed now applications must be submitted through the web portal only offline applications and applications through emails shall not be entertained so there is a web portal i'll show you the link for that as well so there's a web portal you can go there and you can apply for the same after the deadline no applications shall be accepted fine now selection procedure i'll tell you the deadline as well don't worry for the selection procedure there would be a preliminary screening of applications based on your resume and your details that you give apart from that followed by an interview which will be in online mode and from the department some mentors or faculty would take that interview and that selection is based on academic performance participation or recognition in competitions such as olympiads national talent search exams and the performance in the interview fine so you should be good at your subjects you should be good with your fundamentals you should have done some good projects fine to go here if you do not have them do not get bogged down try building something asap and apply for it for example if you somebody who doesn't have good projects put a good project from the top 5 projects video that i have given you fine i have given you resume description as well put it in your resume give that resume to them and before they call you build that build that fastly in 7 days so that you can get selected here then this is the timeline for this show 2025 program on 4th of feb they announced inviting the applications due date for submission of the online form is 5 of the march 2025 declaration of results would happen on 10th of april 2025 tentatively theek hai and the start of the program tentatively would be around 15th of may fine so notification of selection how that would happen you would receive emails from iit hyderabad and the final list of selected interns shall also be displayed on the src office web page under the news announcement section fine so there you can find on the iit hyderabad page communication let me tell you specifically no separate communication would be sent only to the selected candidates email would go to non selected candidates no communication would go fine and the decision of iit hyderabad authorities shall be final in the selection fine it is binding on everybody and all the candidates who are fulfilling the eligibility criteria that would have to be decided by iit hyderabad so no correspondence shall be entertained in that case fine now if i tell you this is the application link and this is the application form link so here at this particular link you will find the details here you can simply go and fill the form now if you want me to guide you through the form as well it is your responsibility make sure that 10000 views come to this video if they come i will specifically build a video showing you how to fill the form how to go to these links how to find proper things in the website also if you give 10000 views to this video i have some special announcement in the end that i'll make and if we achieve that mark i'll bring that surprise for you fine so wait till the end for that now second is iit palakkad internship and this internship program is a summer internship program which is for undergraduate students and postgraduate students and it would be a six week residential program and it combines hands on training with variety of hardware as well as software analysis tools and the eligibility is for science engineering and humanities it is open to post graduate students including fourth and fifth year students of integrated master programs so for all those who are in btech or mtech programs even for the fourth and fifth year students it is open and those who are in third and fourth year of their bachelor's degree in engineering and technology or sciences if you are btech mtech b if you are in btech not mtech if you are in btech be any of the engineering degrees then if you are a third or fourth year student you are eligible for this application is to be again submitted through portal only on the home page of iit palakkad it is available selection will be made on the basis of academic record aptitude for research accomplishments and areas of research interest fine only those who satisfactorily complete the program will be given internship certificate so if you do not do the work correctly here you will not be given a certification but if you manage to do good and most of you who will be selected would manage to do good because people who are mentoring you there are just exceptional fine so this can help you a lot so you can go ahead 
you can complete the program you'll get the internship certificate financial support of rupees 8000 per month which basically means a stipend of 8000 per month would be given to you and 12000 for entire period so basically entirely lump sum amount that you'll get is 12000 will be provided to all the selected candidates accommodation on a shared basis is available on campus hostel room rent along with mess food charges is to be paid by the student or the intern fine students from iit palakkad are not eligible so iit palakkad students aren't your competition all tier 2 tier 3 students this is for you all the people who are studying in tier 2 tier 3 colleges this opportunity can altogether transform your journey of learning things because it is not just about researching in these institutes it is about meeting people जिन लोगों से मिलोगे वो लोग दिमाग नेक्स्ट डायमेंशन पे खोल देंगे ठीक है वहां पर जो लोग इतने साल से प्रोफेसर्स हैं जो कटिंग एज टेक्नोलॉजी पे काम कर रहे हैं उनके पास रिसोर्सेज हैं वो सब एक्सेस कर पाओगे समझ रहे हो वहां के जो बच्चे अच्छे हैं पढ़ने वाले हैं ठीक है वो बच्चे जो थोड़े से कुछ नया रिसर्च कर रहे हैं या कुछ नया करते हैं या ऑन्टरप्रनोर माइंड है उन सबसे मिलोगे ठीक है सो दैट इज वाई इट इज अ ग्रेट अपॉर्चुनिटी फॉरन नेशनल करेंटली स्टडिंग इन इंडियन यूनिवर्सिटीज will be treated on par with Indian nationals. So, if you are an Afghani student or Nigerian student, hai, if you are somebody who is from Afghanistan or Nigeria and you are studying in India, why am I saying this? Because a lot of Afghani and Nigerian students study in my university where I come from. Fine. So, all those people would be treated on par with Indian nationals. So, you also can apply for this. Fine. Now, these are the important dates. So, application portal opened on 29 January. The deadline for foreign nationals is 25 February. The deadline for Indian nationals or others is for March 18. Declaration of selection list of foreign nationals is March 11. For others, the declaration of selection list would be on April 8, 2025. Deadline to confirm participation for foreign nationals studying abroad is March 18. Deadline to confirm participations for all the Indian students is April 15, 2025. On May 21, this program starts and it ends on July 2, 2025. Fine. So this is the basic timeline of it. And you can go ahead. You can find this application link. You can click on that. Now, how to apply? First of all, read the eligibility and instructions and go through the list of internship positions that are available for summer 2025. Do identify the area of interest, the research interest that is aligning with your goals. Fine. Now, how to find that? If you make this video reach 10,000 views, I will be personally telling you how to identify that. But what you can do is, you either can identify or if you want to simplify that through me, go ahead, spread it on your Instagram handles, spread it on your WhatsApp statuses, spread this video as much as you can. If we hit the 10,000 mark, I will give you that information as well in the next video. Don't worry. Fine. Now, you create a new account and then a welcome message comes. Then you log into it, create your password, you upload your documents, you upload proper signed and scanned copy of the authority which is certifying that you are the bona fide student and your details fine so for that you have to get a letter from the head of your institution get it signed and sealed and upload that and then for converting cgpa to percentage you should use the formula percentage of marks is equal to 10 into cgpa fine when you fill all the pages carefully when you fill all the details carefully preview the application once once you have done that, you can make the minor changes to the submitted applications before the closing date using the link in the application or the applicant menu on the right. But after making any changes, when you submit application, then after that, you can't make any change. Fine. So if I go ahead and if I tell you that apart from this, uh, apart from IIT Palakkad, there is one more internship which is being offered by IIT Madras, which is the summer fellowship program. And this is for two months with a stipend that is designed to enhance awareness. Basically, it is about academic research that you can pursue in engineering, you can pursue in sciences, even in management and humanities. So all the management students, MBA students, you can look out for this internship. So candidates pursuing third year of UG, undergraduation, which is BE, BTEC, BSc, engineering, or third or fourth year of integrated dual degree, which is ME, MTech, MSc or first year of MSc, MA, MBA with outstanding academic background in the terms of high ranks in university, they are encouraged to apply 
highlighting their academic performance, achievements, if you have cleared any national talent exam, if you have cleared any Olympiad, go ahead, tell it, or if you have received any other award or distinction or any national level exam you have cleared, fine. So the period of the summer fellowship program is from 19th of May 2025 to 18th of July 2025. A stipend that you'll get here would be of rupees 15,000 per month and the maximum period for two months it would be given prorated according to two months. So fine, so you can consider 15,000 a month and for two months you'll be living here. Hostel and mess facility will be provided on payment basis. So you have to pay for it. You have to cater for it subject to availability that, that would be given to you. Fine. Now, these are the participating engineering departments aerospace engineering, applied mechanics, biomedical engineering, biotech, chemical, civil, computer science, data science and AI, engineering design, electrical engineering, metallurgical, medical science and technology. You can check these uh, engineering departments. Even the ocean engineering department is participating into it. Now for science departments, physics, chemistry, mathematics, humanities and social uh, sciences, management studies, these departments are actually participating into it. So you can check here as well. Fine. So, when you have done this, there is no need to send any hard copy of your applications. The submitted applications can be viewed in the portal using username and password that would be sent to your registered email address. Apart from this, please ensure that you put all the relevant data, all the enclosures. If you say that I have qualified this particular exam, give the details for that exam. Fine. Incomplete applications would be rejected, so you should not do that. And letter from your university, college should certify that you are bona fide student and it should be signed and stamped by the head of the institution. Fine. If you are in an autonomous college, your director or dean would do that. If you are in a university, again, your director or dean, whoever is the head of your institution would do that. Fine. The portal would be activated on 3rd February 2025. The last date for online submission is 28th of February at 8 p.m. Or sorry, at 5 p.m. So it is at 5 p.m. It would end. So before that, you should fill it out. Now, I have one very interesting announcement. I have few more internships for you people in the research institutes only. But I can only give you that if you make this video reach a mark of 12 or 13,000 views. I should rather set a target of 12,000 views for you. Let's make it easy for you. You share it as much as you can. Tell students as much as you can. I'm specifically telling you, I will provide you more bonus opportunities in IITs only. Fine, in IITs and some other research institutes which are of national stature. So I'll give you those internships. I'll give you those opportunities. I'll tell you about them. and. If you reach that mark, I'll also go ahead and show you the forms, how you can fill these forms. I'll show you the proper application process as well. Fine. So that way I would, I would feel rewarded for all the hard work that I am putting in for you people. But apart from that, ek baat dhyan rakna, whoever needs this knowledge, if you feel your junior or senior, kisi ko bhi zarat hai, free mein chahe, aap bataye, koi dikkat nahi hai. Theek hai? The reason is spread the knowledge as much as you can. My goal is that, as simple as that, I want the knowledge to be spread more than my name, as simple as that. Alongside that, keep doing good for people. Keep doing good without any expectation. Good will come back to you. That's all I can say. And have a wonderful day ahead. Go reach out to these institutions. Go fill out the forms and change your destiny, change your career altogether. Have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.